I think I've switched to Drow Titan a bit early. I actually decided to do something a little bit different this time. And instead of just doing like a day in each like alignment, I decided to just try to do five hours in each faction. Let me see each of them in the current meta sort of a little bit. And uh, I saved Titans for last. And eight hours ago, I hit them. As you can tell, I actually did spend extra time in Elven because Elves are just so good right now. Anyway. Um, it's kind of annoying. Oh, yeah, by the way, this. I should talk about this. Uh, I think I figured out how they made events good for longtime players. They did it in a way I didn't expect. See, I saw this at first. It was like, increase your event mo bonus by 50%. Okay, you know, I didn't think a whole lot of it. It was kind of cool. But now this. Increase the production of aligned buildings based on time spent as your least used alignment of this reincarnation. Available during any seasonal event. So every event is going to give me another thing. And that's how all events will be good for high-end players. I think. So, I'm happy about that. Sadly, the event's about to end. I think I'm going to just let this run overnight. I think I'm just going to let it run until I can get the Archon Trade Treaty. Once I get that, I mean, I'll have power! And, you know because I'll immediately be able to select more researches, and it, it'll, yeah, everything will just kind of gel. And probably just Drow Titan all the way. Probably. Drow Titan are really good. I mean, there's other builds. There's some other really good builds. Actually, I, I think I've been ending, yeah, I've been using Undead at the end of each one, so I'll probably switch to Undead um, at the end again. Unless I come up with something different. It's actually amazing. I'm only four gems behind, considering how much of this hasn't quite clicked yet. Huh. Well, anyway. Well, unfortunately, the Asmodian time is over. But I made the most of the event and have another prize to take with me to the next one. So... So, um, so let's talk a tiny bit about, I'm still admiring the new art now that it's not a trophy. Anyway, let's talk a tiny bit about how this is working out. So basically, I am five, yes, five days into this, this uh, reincarnation. I put five hours, well, more or less, I mean, you know, <laughs> sleep and work and things I'm not p quite able to be perfect about. I did pretty good at putting five to six hours on all of them before pushing into, uh, I ended up using Elven a bunch and then switching over to Titans. I don't know that I found any faction to be particularly great, like the Elves were just amazing. Uh, I used face out, Faceless for the build-up early, early. And then I, I think it just goes Faceless, Elves, um, Titans. So anyway, uh, Drow Titans are still amazing. I suppose this is... I, I could do them one more time, I guess. But this is probably about the time to hand it off to Undead, maybe? Um, probably. I think... But uh, it's fussier to get all these five all these five hours in. But I think it helps on a whole. At the very least, it would make Strange Attraction better if I actually had enough coins to get that. I figure it takes me about a week per reincarnation, give or take. I think if I decide to do another. Um, Titan run is going to take probably at least. I mean, do I really need this many uh, checks? Oh, I also took uh, excavations. I'll probably reset that a few times again. 
I've already done a bunch of soft resets because, because you know, there are things that actually use my soft resets to determine uh, how good they are somewhere. Yeah, here it is. Absent mindedness. Because, yeah, even soft resets are a thing. But, yeah, I don't think I could. I mean, maybe with some radically different strategy that's way more efficient. Maybe if I was perfect, of course, as always. But, uh. I don't know. I don't think I could make it too much faster than a week per reincarnation right now. I think that's just my speed at present. kind of want to go undead, but I'm still iffy. I feel like it's probably a mistake and I'll waste time and I'd be better off just doing one more Titan run to, to get all the way through the Archon abilities and then hit the undead. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway. Let's do some free resets. We two, three, four, five. Oh dear, so many. Seven, eight. Oh, eight. So a total of eighteen, bringing this up to whoa it is not linear growth it is multiplicative is it now hmm I mean offline bonus well I mean there are some things that offline bonus can plug into among my researches Let me see now, let's increase offline production. Hmm. I know there's a few of these that, that can factor that in. Let's see. There's one of them. What else? Hmm. Hmm. How big an impact is this going to have? I wonder. Probably not as much as I'm hoping. <laughs> anyway, uh, if I'm able to get up to Arcane Core. Yeah, I think I should just do one more Titan run. So, you know, Dark Elves. Hmm. Druid Set. And the Titans. I wish I could say I'd come up with some fancy trick for this, but it's really just hit that, and then whatever. It doesn't doesn't even matter what you click on past that. Well, I mean, it does, but you're going to end up with uh, more picks, so you just kind of get everything that's good. Hmm. So, I'm actually, at this point, Elves is a good aligned one. Then I go to Neutral for Titans, and then I go to Evil for uh, Undead. I'm actually using all three alignments. Wait a minute. Two of them are Order. One of them is, new is Balance. Uh, I am using Faceless at the beginning still, though I don't have to. I am. So I'm using just a smidge of Chaos. But on a whole, of all the uh, factions, I'm making the least use of Chaos at this time. Although, I do use the Jin lineage in combination with my Undead, so... So, it's, it's still in there. It still actually is a major factor. Alright... Anyway, I can go to bed and leave it in this state. And the funny thing is, I really don't have to worry too much because 
just just time on the clock is really valuable when you're, you know, running the Archon. Well, when you have Bloodspring and you're in order, because you'll eventually get the Archon. Because you're going to just need those hours to pass anyway. It's the only drawback. If only there was a way I could speed it up even more. But the Dark Elves are the best I get in that department. Maybe it takes a little more than a week. The undead take build up time too. Ah, well. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, until next time and every time, this is Hadrix signing off. Bye. All right. So, we're just about on the cusp of reincarnation and let me go ahead and pick another round of stuff hmm what do we want eh so I'm actually thinking about shifting gears and going for lineage uh, at this point let me see, what do we want here? It's such a good bonus, but it's additive, and it was pointed out to me, yeah, that, that, that it's additive, and I'm just like, well, crap. Because it's such a nice bonus, but it's not actually going to help me much. So, uh, if I can't have that, I guess I could take a mana regen bonus. But why? Or I could take engraving for more faction coins? I mean, that's alright. Man, I want this one. Fine, I'll take that. So we've got smuggling. So I was told this one's actually good. I always like to take these kind of ones to, to get the more buildings, but I without any number to go on, I didn't think, but hey, it's, people are saying it's good. What, it's not even worth a thousand Olympian halls? You guys sure it's good? <laughs> You sure? You sure about that? Really? Is there some mistake? I'll take that. Hmm. Because, I mean, I got some other options in here that are pretty nice. Economics is just a really good set. Great stuff all over the place. Hmm. Well, let's see. My options here are the 20% from Transcendence, or increase pro assistant production by 25%, or Solemnity, which doesn't tell me how much it does. So, I mean, hmm. I mean, this would also get me more faction coins, and yeah, but fine, I'll take that. All right, let me see what else we got. What else we got? Hmm. Maybe if I just stopped showing people my researches, I wouldn't get complaints. Hmm. No, 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 I won't do that. Um. Is there anything particularly great left I could have in crafts? I suppose I could take this. I mean, you know. It would be... Let me see. Never mind. I guess I'll just take magnetism. Hmm... 
Forty-two percent. Should we go pay? Should we make that buy work? Boom, 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 boom. What the? How can I? How come the Olympian halls aren't being affected? I'm able to buy thousands of these, but the Olympian halls, I can't. There it is. Five. What? Okay, fine. Never mind. I take it back. Apparently, it's great. <laughs> That's actually a pretty good number to get there. Go away, mosquito. It's one of those little tiny mosquitoes. <laughs> Hopefully, it's not being picked up by the mic. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay. So I'll let this run for a bit. I think what I should do is I should just try to get the highest gem count I can. Just push this as far as I can go. We'll have to switch to undead next, methinks. Then I'll have to work on, I really think I should work the lineages up another, another couple notches. I'm kind of tempted to just keep reincarnating though. Hmm. Well. Well, anyway. I'm just uh, rolling about trying different things just to see, uh, just to try different builds at this level. I happened to go for, uh, I didn't really expect anything out of Angels, to be honest, but I thought I'd try, and I ended up getting a few... More than a few levels in Maker's Lineage out of it, so it wasn't a total waste of time. Um, I really can't recommend this build. I suppose if I got a few more researches in, I could do something with it. What that something is, I don't know. Just doesn't seem to be as good as the undead, honestly. Hmm. Maybe if I'd gone with Jin build, nah, this is, I don't know. Mm. Yeah, I wasn't really expecting much out of Angels. Anyway, I'm going to keep experimenting, running down different things and see what I can get. Uh, let's see what it's like at a very high gem count to run Elves's. Sure, why not? Give them a try. The goal is going to be to get my lineage levels way up. Um, probably going to use goblins for that, but but for the time being, I can experiment just a little, just because I wanna. Hmm. Hmm. We're gonna take that one still. Anyway. I'll just carry on. Holy shit. I mean, look at the elves. I've only been... Oh my gosh. It's been less than... I haven't even been casting my spells for a minute yet. <coughs> wow. Jeez. Frickin' elves, man. Yeah, champions. Holy crap. Actually, we're not even far from being able to put lineage levels in. If I passed a little time, if I passed a day like this, I would be able to pick up more researches. I'm really impressed with them. I did not expect the elves to be this strong this far in. Maybe I've been underestimating them. I was only using them kind of in the middle. Whew. Wow. Um, I'll keep this in mind. I will keep this in mind. Hmm. 
Well, without even trying, the elves have managed to get a lineage level. I don't think they'll be uh, getting another just now, but still. If I stayed in this long enough to get more research picks, I mean... I mean, look at this. I was going to run around and do other things, but it's only been three hours. I mean, I should just, just do a couple more elf runs and pick up a few more gems, eh? Seems... Seems like it's worth doing. <laughs> really impressed me. I'm honestly shocked at how good fairies are. I mean, they're not as good as elves, but... They're almost competitive. If I waited to pick up some more, uh... Researches, maybe they'd even be good. But I'm not waiting. Let's see, who do we feel like trying now? Well, let's just do the faceless. I want to see how they do at this point. Obviously, we want the Archons. Hmm. Well, I mean, it's a pretty good number there. I mean, how can I say no? How could I say no to that? Okay. Thunk, 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 thunk. Get that. I haven't even taken a research yet. I suppose I should be doing that now. Anyway, we'll see how the uh, faceless do. Wow. That's, um... Doesn't really seem like that's gonna... Keep being told I should be picking this all the time, but... I mean... It's, uh... Well, we'll see what it looks like when I've got the rest in play, I guess. But I need this. I need this. This one's probably, yeah. Oh, yes, that's better. Well, anyway, uh, I need that. I need gravitation. Yeah, okay, that'll make things work. Gen though, man. That's some pretty intense regen. Mm, smuggling. Increase bonus from gems. I don't think I've got anything increasing my bonus from gems. I don't think I have anything increasing my bonus from gems right now, do I? Trying to remember all the abilities. There's so many. Oh, I'll have to dig. 
Hmm. Is there... Is there anything affecting gems? Wait, is there an easy... Is there a lazier way I can do this? There's gotta be a lazier way. Okay, hold on. Alright, let's see. Well, I'll know if I... Here, here's what I'll do. Uh, export. Alright. 2.6 E10. Yeah, no, that was good. I didn't think there was anything boosting my gems here. Alright, good. Good, good. But I do like bri bribing. <laughs> All right. Now let me consider. Where is eight e six? Nope. Okay, I feel like I'm free and clear to pick something else. Well, I mean, I guess I don't need faction coins after all. But do you want them? What do I need? Hmm. Maybe I should have gone with something else. Then I could take this Philosopher's Stone. Increase my energy gen even more! Hmm. Fine, whatever, I'll go with it. Gonna keep building up now. Wow, twenty four hours. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Now I needed to target the pavilion based on faction coins, right? So, but even if I did that. And if I did that, it wouldn't matter. Hmm. No, faces definitely don't go to this level. Even if I gave them time, they can't come close. Uh, even if one or two of my research picks is off, it's still not even close. So! I will keep experimenting. Titans! Really, I should stay as drow. I really like them with the drow. What if I gave them gin or maker? Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to do multiple runs as the titans and find out. Anyway. Uh, I'll only record if I find anything worthwhile. I really, really wasn't expecting druids to be any good at this height, but they're actually pretty decent. Shockingly so. Huh. So, elves are good, druids are good. <laughs> hmm. Is there a nature-themed evil? Faction. No. No, there isn't. Goblins don't count. <laughs> these are these are bank goblins, not forest goblins. All right, what are we gonna run first? 
guess we'll go on dead. I usually been using the Jin bloodline in combination with them. I just like the Jin bloodline more than the uh, Maker's bloodline. And of course, I like the shiny new ones just in general. Okay, wait, do we say undead, right? So, whoops. So, through the night. All night long. Hmm. I'll just give the undead set for the moment. That might be wrong. That might just be wrong at this point. Oh, I don't have an undead sitting around. Ugh. Well, I'll make all my picks and do all my stuff. Let's see. The obvious picks. Hmm. I'm gonna need faction coins, right? Should probably pick those first. I suppose I can get Gem Duster later. I should probably take Gravitation for now. Do I have enough? Hmm. What we're missing is... Hmm... Yeah, I desperately need to get faction coins. So I'm gonna say... Gravitation. Hmm. Anyway, it'll build up through the night. I'll wake up. I should have a bunch of stuff from uh, it building up. And then the undead is generally pretty good, right? Oh, uh, 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 yep, yep, yep. It's starting to come together. Starting to come together already. So let's see. Uh, that'll take a little bit of time. So, like I said, it'll all be there in the morning. Hmm. I didn't expect that the undead would be behind the elves and druids, but they are, and by a fair margin, too. Hmm. Well. Next up, we have the demons. Oh, uh, let's see. It's fairly obvious what I should pick here. Hmm. See, there's multipliers and things that make this more complicated. Ugh. I'll go with Undead again. I don't know if that's the right pick. Ugh. Of course, the usual picks. Uh, well, actually... Fine, I'll take it. Right, right, I get two picks right off the bat. Right, of course. Of course, of course. This bonus was insane while I was undead, by the way. Not that that helps me much. Right now... Hmm. 
econ, the econ ones. Oh, what am I gonna do with the economy ones? Let's see, I still need blood spring if I wait and pick that up. If I wait 24 hours, I can has it. Oh, hey, look at that. No, it's the drow that make that amazing, not the undead. Right. Hmm. All right. So... Getting everything fairly easily. Particularly since I pushed faction coins hard. If I don't... I won't wait for the extra, um... Research picks unless I think I'm going to make a gain by it. So... Hmm... Hmm... There's that. Of course, the combo strike would need to be built up. Well, we'll see how this goes. First, I get this. Then maybe, I mean, both Limited Wish and Combo Strike want to take the time to build up, so... There's, of course, Maelstrom, which needs to target the evil fortresses, of all things. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to have to go fishing for it. After this, I'll probably just go and do some runs. Uh, I'll do a, specifically a uh, excavation run and get as many soft resets and things in as possible. Yeah. That's probably what I do next. A little bit unstable. The evil fortress is, mm, seems to be the major building most of the time. Except when the burning abyss takes over. Hmm. Hmm. I need an evil fortress by faction coins or trophies, apparently. Really? Trophies are acceptable now? Huh. Assistance would work too. In fact, really. Mana produced is the only one that's not really all that great. All right. Okay. All right. I guess faction coin found is, is going to outdistance it, but you know it'll be close enough to see, and that's all I need. And I'm not impressed. Even if I build up the combo strike and the limited wish, I'm 
if I build up both of those and take another bat round of researches. I mean, I feel like I should test this, but I don't want to give this 24 hours to... I'm just not feeling it. I just don't think so. I just I just don't think this is this will work. So I'm going to write it off without trying. <laughs> Leave a comment about how I've made the most terriblest mistake, and that actually demons are the ultimate faction if I'd only give them a chance. I'm going to go do my dig run now. The elves seem like they're the best faction to me. Right now, if I just want to do want to do quick work. Well there. I need this. Probably that. Okay. And then... The digging shall begin. <sighs> hmm. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Just, just boom. Even with excavation as one of the picks. Hmm. Well then. Shame I can't combine Hall of Origination with the Titans and just double pack this building here. Or High Bastion with the demons, actually. <laughs> no Ruby? Oh, I should be reaching new depths here, I think. Well. With the Easter event, I would be, but alas. So, eh, I'll let this run a bit, come back to it, do all that, and then it'll be goblin time. Well, I think that's enough excavating. I did a lot of resets. So, it's time for the only faction left. Goblins! Naturally, they get Archon. This, we plan for this to be a long run. There's only, there's only one obvious pick here among the evils. Goblins! Goblin, goblin. Because we're all about the uh, building up the lineage here. So, it actually doesn't matter which researches I pick because this is going to be a long run as I'm going to want to pick all the researches. When I've driven the Archons way, way, way up, then, well not all the researches, but the relevant ones at least, when I've driven the Archon lineage way, way up, maybe to 50 even, maybe even to 51, I don't know, we'll see, that's probably over ambitious. But once I've completed that, I can start working on the other lineages. So, first picks. Hmm. I mean, I know we want all the faction coins. We'll, 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 we'll end up getting lots more picks over time. Hmm. No, 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 this one. Very important. That one is very important. 
Hmm. Actually, this one works very well with the uh, Goblin Bank thing. We'll get smuggling later. And of course, this one. And these two. <laughs> this one's good. Capacity is going to start rising soon. Womp! A noticeable impact. That probably doesn't really matter. Okay. And boom. Boom. Okay. So, let's try to factor in all the things we got going for us. So we got all that taken care of. Super quick and easy. We're not likely to gain gems during the... Well, then again, we might. I don't know. We'll see. It could happen. When we get a ton of researches in, maybe. All right, let's see. So... Hmm. Look at that. Ah! Crazy high bonus. So. 180. Whoo! 183 now. So, yeah. Alright. So, in 24 hours, I'll get my first pick. And then 24 hours after that, no, wait, I think it's more than that. Anyway, we'll probably be running this. This will probably be running for like five days. <laughs> the next patch may come out while I'm still working this. But the Archon bloodline, I think, is most important. Unfortunately, the second most important lineage is um, Drow, which I can't actually use the goblins for, but... We'll see how that goes. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this off. I might as well build an enormous combo strike. There. Might as well build an enormously massive combo strike. since this is going to go on for days. <laughs> right then. It begins. What is... Nane? Nane, right there. Nane, zero percent. What is Nane, zero percent? If it said Nani, I'd be like, oh, it's Japanese. Still wouldn't know why it was there, but at least... All right, let me see. Uh, I need my settings. We need to change this. Okay. One million zero percent. No, just one million percent? Well, I mean, <laughs> how, does, how does that end up being na, ne, zero percent, though? I probably shouldn't pick this, but I'm going to do it anyway. It's enormous. Is this broken? Wait, what? Wait, what's happening? Is it negative? Is it a negative number? It is. No, wait, I'm still gaining emerald coins even when it's... Huh? What is this? 
What is happening? If I'm being reduced to, like, almost a tenth of my usual production, well, okay, better than that, but still, if I'm if my production's reduced, I should see this number ticking slow. But no, this continues to move at the same speed, regardless of what this says. Look at that, look at that, look at the, the coins per second. It's going along, and then it suddenly becomes zero percent. It's clearly hurting me. It's clearly making me weaker, On according to that. But this... seems to just keep on trucking. Can I take it back? I don't I don't think I want this ability. Can I can I take it back? I should have saved before I clicked it. Why did I click shit? You know what it doesn't matter. Actually, I don't care. Well, I mean, okay, I care a little bit cuz I have more goblin banks, but still, all I really care about is faction coins. I regret this, but there'll probably be a patch in a day or two that fixes whatever the hell's going on here. I'll go, I'll go report it anyway. Yay! I just tripled my my assistant count with golems. Ah, uh, what else do I want? Well, I mean that one's good. I'll take that one. I'll, I'll want that one later too, of course. Uh, do, do, do. What do we want? Reduce real exchange multiplier. I mean that's nice. I do like that. Hmm. Let's see, what do we want? I could always take royal demand. Oh, look at that. I could pick up diplomacy. People get mad when I take that one. <laughs> uh, I actually want this one. I'm, I'm going to end up with a whole bunch. I'm going to start having to pick duds eventually anyway, so, you know, I don't have to be too picky. Increase bonus from gems. Nope, don't really need that. Shame it's not multiplicatively. Oh, engraving. Yeah, an extra 100%. Huh. Yeah, scavenging is uh, pretty awesome right now. <laughs> no, I just tripled my assistance. It's even better. Uh, what do we want? I guess I can just take this. No, not that. This. There. Shame I can't get that to work on banks. Wouldn't that be nice? Well, anyway. More Archon lineage. I don't think I'll be doing any more offline time. Whoa, that was a lot. I mean, I know I just took a research for it and everything, but... Oh, that's a lot! <laughs> Banks, please. That's the only thing I really want. What the hell is happening here? What is this? It bothers me, okay? What is this? None as zero percent. I don't know what that means. I tried changing notations. You'll see it eventually when I put out the actual video. But I tried switching it to other notations to see it, and it was like one m percent, one one million percent, one m as in the Roman numeral for a thousand. One. What do you mean? What does that mean? So I clicked it, and I wish I hadn't. I should have saved before I clicked on it, but I was like, eh, I've got all these res I'm, I'm going to eventually have a ton of researches anyway, because I'm doing the long game here. So what's one pick? Well, watch, yeah, you've probably noticed by now what's happening over here. 
Do, do you see this? What the hell is happening here? No, it, I, I, it, it, what's really baffling is you watch this number and watch that this number continues to go up even when I'm greatly reduced over here. Like, it looks like this is being reduced down to a 22 a second. Actually, it's a little variable, but... So while it's reduced to such a slow rate, you'd expect to see an equ equivalent slowdown on this side, but you don't. Am I making sense? I'm confused as hell. Maybe I, all the words coming out of my mouth are confused too. I don't know. Realm Grinder just cast confusion on me. What the hell is going on? What is this? So I assume somebody already knows exactly what's going to go on, going on and can explain it to me. Thanks, please. Alright. This should be the last round of researches I'm going to do. So. Pretty sure I want formation. What else do we want? What else do we want? Improve offline production. You know, that could plug into a couple of things. Increase mana regen. <laughs> Useless. But it does plug into a couple of things. Really, I can only get 11%? You know how many of those I've purchased at this point? I mean, offline production. But then... Only if this was if this were max man, I'd be ecstatic. Uh, who knows? Maybe I'll do one more round of researches. Probably not, but you know, you might. Might happen. Probably not though. Hmm. It's a nice royal exchange bonus there. Manages to surpass inflation. Forget what I have. I think I have something impacting Royal Exchange already pretty heavily. I just can't think of what it is. Unless I'm mixing my builds up. Of course, excavations are nice, but let's let's just do this. Okay. I think really transcendence is gonna be the best. Transfiction is actually looking okay. Hmm. I'm gonna go with Transcendence, though. It's just the, like the obvious pick. Uh, hmm. Is there anything left here? Well, that's a pretty big bonus. But let's take a moment to, to, to see. Yep, it doesn't matter. You are irrelevant, Woodcraft. Hmm. There's, there's nothing here. Meh. So my gem bonus is so high already. Alright, and then... Mesmer. And I wish I had projection. Okay. Now... I've had this turned off all this time, so we turn this on. Full power. Pick up two more. Okay. Can I get to 50? 50 would be nice. 
great thing about this is as little as this contributes, and then you add this over here, which is a major contribution. I think it's like 500%. Is that right? No, 668%. Nice. So, 600% boost might actually... It's not moving. I was going to suggest, but this is not moving. But it should be. It should be building up faster. A little bit, anyway. Got this. Without even meaning to. This not not going to happen. Because that max mana is locked. If I could make the max mana and the mana regen match, then I could have this, too. But still is the first time I've had the highest level of one of these. Hmm. So, look at how many factions, how many royal exchanges I've got. Man, should be better than that. Stupid research. Yeah, at this point, there's really nothing I can do to increase my faction coins any further. I think I'm going to end up with just one more level. Ugh. Pity. Pity that I can't squeeze more out of this. 49 isn't bad, though. 49 isn't bad. And from here, I can go and I can start working on the other factions thanks to the pocket watch. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. Did Cryomancy finally stabilize? When did that happen? No nans. Oh, well. Cool. Alright then. The game didn't get an update or anything. <laughs> that bug's still on the loose. It just, uh, isn't impacting me anymore. So hooray. And fifth, ooh. New perk for the lineage. Archon perk five. Unique buildings count 100% more. 100% more for all things? Wait, 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 wait. Does that include 100% I need to get this to 51 to make it easier to get the others to 50. I wasn't aware there was a 50 perk. I mean, I'm sure, you know, everyone else knew. I, uh, You know I've tried to avoid spoilers. So, all of a sudden, that changes things. Yeah, I need this to be 51, bare minimum. But hey, that 100% will help. Okay. Alright. I'll go ahead and do this, because you know, why not? Let's see if I have it in the morning. I'll take however long it takes. I must have it. Must. Absolutely must. Must. 